So today was meant to be the camping trip where I test out all my gear, but um, I don't think I don't think that's a good idea. Now it would have been nice obviously to test out all the camping gear and test out the bike, the windshield, all the stuff we spoke about last week. Um, but that's cool, you know, it's rained out and um, and also we don't actually have our camping stuff uh, sorted yet. So we need to do that today. We're doing that today. We're gonna catch up with Nick, uh, see what he's doing in the workshop. He's in the workshop today. He's been in there since this morning, putting all his new mods on and everything. He did some work done to it. He's a 2008 Tiger 1050. And yeah, like it's, it's two weeks, two weeks till the big trip. I hope it's not like this when we leave. That would be, that would suck. Damn, that would suck. Wouldn't that suck, Amelia? It's the cat, she's, she's off me. I interrupted her, she was sitting right here before. And uh, she's, she just gets disturbed really quickly. Anyway, so we're gonna hang out with Nick. We're gonna go camping, shopping. I'll show you guys right now, the stuff that I've bought so far, again, this last week. There's not much, but I think it's just good to show you. Let's go. I'm sorry, kitty, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Check this out. This just came in yesterday, the new Foresight Smart Helmet. I'm gonna be doing the unboxing for that um, next week. Next week's vid is the unboxing of this. I'm gonna keep this all freshly sealed. Look at this. That's gonna be, it's gonna look the exact same. I'm gonna just do it for you guys. I'm gonna hold off until I share it with you guys. I'm gonna share the excitement. Heaps of comments on my video last week. Thank you so much for commenting. I really do appreciate it. Um, and like heaps of tips, you guys shared all your well, your expertise in the field. So me and Nick have never really done this before. So we really appreciate any hot tips that you can lend us. One of which being, Pat was just like, man, get yourself some camel packs. You'll just, you'll, you know, thank him later, basically. So we did, there's like 25 bucks, two liters. We'll be taking some other drink bottles and drinking containers, obviously for the water and some spare fuel, etc. cetera. Uh, we also got ourselves some delicious <laughs> dehydrated food, um, you know, full of nutrients. So we thought we'll give them a crack. They're all like, the bowl's all ready made in it and stuff like that. It's pretty cool, pretty handy. Just add hot water and away you go, baby. This one's spaghetti bolognese. Yummy, yummy. And what we also got are these things, man. So these things are called moto skivvies. Yeah, basically undies with some padding around your buttocks. Pretty weird, <laughs> pretty weird. Um, Nick tested them out yesterday. We were walking around the camping store and um, he was he was having a wow of a time. He, he hated it. He actually hated it so much just because it's like, you just get right into your butt crack apparently. Um, but they're not made for walking around, I guess. They're made for long endurance riding. So we thought we'd pick a set up each. <laughs> not to share, because that would be weird. They're, around, like, they're like 125 bucks though, so they're quite expensive. And uh, so I hope, they, I hope we get our money's worth. But what is also serving our buttocks, uh, Louis Moto. So if you haven't heard of Louis Moto, check them out. Link will be in the description. Um, they're sending us out their gel, like their comfort seat gel. That you sort of have to install yourself. So you cut out your foam in your seat. I'll make up a video on it as well so I can show you guys what the hell I'm talking about. But thank you so much Louis Moto. Keen as to when they come in. Also coming are uh, the Steady Lights. So Steady Lights have hooked us up with spotlights, floodlights. Um, I'm replacing my whole headlamp, so no more halogen. I'm going all LED. Heaps better spread, um, so I'm super keen, so, so keen to hook that up. I love lights, man. I've been wanting to do lights for ages. Uh, so lights are gonna be fantastic. Thank you, Mr. Much Steady. They're on the way. Order was finalized yesterday, so cannot wait to see that come in, baby. <laughs> so yeah, that's where we're at. That's where we're at so far. So let's go and check out Nick's setup. We go and hang out with him, see what he's up to, and then we'll go shopping. Trippy. I'm not moving. Let's give him a call. Where's Nick? Yo, dude. Um, where you at? Are you in the? Are you in the shop? Yeah, bro. What's up? I'm just parked at the front. Yeah, I'm, I'm in here partying, bro. Sick. All right, I'll come in. 
Ew, ew. All right, let's do this, baby. Ooh. Ah, za, 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 za. So let's have an air summit. We need, we need clearance to be able to get in there. In I can't believe it is weather, man. Actually, like, like yesterday was toasting. It's so warm, and now it's like freezing. I forgot my glasses. And like the craziest thing is, is that it's spring, man. And we had like a whole bunch of days that were like 30 degrees. And now this, it's like chaos. And it's always when you plan a camping trip, always. Uh, let's see if we can get in here, very easy. Oh, it does open, sick. What's going on here, eh? Um, Having a good time? A little party yeah. anyway, yourself? <laughs> yeah, this, this is sick, Surprise Surprised your pants are still on. Yeah, man, uh, I've been putting in the red shot. Um, been here since eight, so five hours. Heck yes. I got another five hours. I'm not rushing, I'm just taking my time. Yeah, I'm having curious. a good time. Yeah. But I've done, so far, update. Mm -hmm. Oil change. Nice. Coolant flush. Nice. Um, I've removed every single body panel, as you can see. Ah. So to work on these kind of bikes, you really want to remove all that. Nice. So all that, this was interesting to get access to the air filter. So Where's I have to lift this whole tank it's down there. Um, oh, but right. surprise, there was a K&M performance filter in there. I saw so. your story, yeah. So That's sick. Right. So it's upstairs drying right now. Um, I'll plug, once that goes in, tank will go back on. Oh, also. The new? Remember that wild bent lever? Oh, yeah, that's right. Where's one? We've got to fix this. All right. And this. So oh, look nice, hey, they're so tiny. Yeah, some very nice force oh, levers. Nice. So they'll give me a uh, nice adjustability if I want to. You know, get a little bit more sharp. Yep. I uh, want to run the dirt. Oh, a uh, surprise! Right. <laughs> Those are yours. Are they mine? Surprise! What? No way! Yeah, surprise! <laughs> that's sick. Ready for when we come back home, hey? Yes, yeah, so that's you. That's, <laughs> oh, that's so, awesome. So, surprise, but you didn't know, but Pirelli hooked you up as well. What? I love so, this guy, Pirelli. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, STR rallies and you keep raving about them, so we got you a pair. Oh my goodness. Uh, I got my. my Look at his smile. Yeah, right. I've been keeping. That's why I've been keeping so hard, man. Uh, but he's going pretty as well. Dope. Oh man, that's gonna be hecked on this. It's gonna be so good. Uh, so yeah, I can't believe that. It's so sick. It's so sick. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so pumped. Thanks, bro. Yeah, thanks, man. Thanks, man. So yeah, so basically. Uh, I got another about four hours of bench time here. Uh -huh. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna actually put the tank down because I'm gonna let the air filter dry for like an hour. Yep. Thanks for going down. I'm actually gonna flip it, secure the rear wheel, jack it up, and then I'm gonna drop the forks. <coughs> drop the forks. Uh, fork seals and dust seals, front and rear wheel bearings, and head stem bearing as well. Um, so all that there. The plan is for today is flip it, take these forks out, take the wheel out. I'm gonna change the tire myself because I I don't have the knowledge to do fork seals or wheel bearings. Yeah. So I'm gonna have get Chris the boys for me. Sure. Basically, what that leads to is the rear tire and wheel bearing uh, and pads will be done next Wednesday. Okay. Cool. Uh, so today, I really hope to get that all disassembled. Yep. Tire changed, and now I'm gonna start putting the engine bars on. I'm going to put the frame sliders on, quad lock on, and that's the goal for the end of the day. If Safe. I can get this, this, and this on, and this whole front end off, and the brake pad swapped at 5.30, I uh, call this a great success! That is a success! <laughs> yeah. Okay, so Nick just pulled the front tire off. Yeah. Long, long boy. And he's gonna put the, the Pirellis on. The Pirelli stopping rallies, STIs. Long boy. <laughs> Are you ready for this? Woo! I'm ready for it. Let's get it. And there we go. There we are, baby. Oh, Rally STR is ready to go. Shout out to Pirelli once again. This is a badass hard. So look how it looks with that. One Oops. second, one second. 
Okay, continue. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so look how look how but yeah, look how dope these uh, Rally SCRs look on that mag wheel. It's obviously AD, ADV bikes all spokes, like kind of uh, the scram scram over there. Mm -hmm. uh, but I just think this looks hot. Like this is, it's really different, this, is huh? this bike is not meant to go off road. And that's why I love it, you know. <laughs> Other than that, fork seals are gonna go get done. And then now it's time to slap on some engine bars, maybe have a little bit of long. Yeah. I'll go from there. We're um, we intercepted the Uber driver. Come past here for another delivery. We're like, no nah, man, we want our food now. <laughs> oh no, that's him. That's him. Is he gonna get it? He did. How good is that? Let's go! <laughs> Sick. So lunch was fantastic. Thanks, man. Cheers, bro. We worked for it. We ran. We ran after that car, ma'am. So, so good. We'd be still hungry. We'd be still sitting here just going, I'm so hungry. So we do engine bars, and then I'm probably going to go home until he does the rest of his stuff. Yeah. Awesome. And then we're going to go shopping. Go camp yeah. shopping. Yeah. Get a tent, get a mat. Uh, and, then, and then, yeah, then that's it. That's it. These are the engine bars, and they go a little something. Oh. Like of this. Like of that. There she lines up there like that. You got it? Hold it. Yeah. yeah. And yep. then this long pole boy. I wouldn't recommend doing this order. Just hold it out a bit. <laughs> Goes in there behind the manifold like that. Donk. And um, and that's it. So it's just those two bolts. There's a lot more. Uh, there's a lot more. Ah, uh, there's all that. So they all go somewhere. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, we'll work it out. Yeah. We'll work it out. Yeah. All right, let's do it. Yeah. Goodbye. Alrighty, goodbye. Ciao. Ciao. Uh, so the engine bars are on. They're on. We've got the little quad lock boy here, wired up and ready to rock and roll. Um, what do we do? Oil's in. Oil's in. Brake caliper, uh, brake pads changed. Brake pads are changed. Yep. On the one set, because you didn't order two sets. So good there. Why do you make say mistakes? that? Why do you make mistakes? You don't need Take two. Pads are done. Viewer <laughs> <laughs> boys. Yep. Put a little cigarette lighter boy in there as well. Oof, that boy there. Yeah, OEM. So it, so, so that's what we'll do the 12 volt and then that will be our uh, What's it for? What's it for? That's gonna be boiling our kettle, baby! <laughs> yeah, but it's uh it's 12 volt from uh cash.com that are you they choose. They're not sponsoring this. No, they're not. Maybe they will, maybe oh, they yeah, will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Granola bars, <laughs> protein bars. Uh, so he's gonna be finishing this bike on Wednesday next week, which is my birthday, so I'm not gonna be helping him. I'm gonna be staying at home doing birthday stuff. What? I'm gonna be staying at home doing birthday stuff, because it's my birthday on Wednesday. But what are you what, what are you doing on Wednesday during the day? What did you want to birthday stuff. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What did you want to spend your birthday with me? Nah, uh, we'll be ah. right back. We'll be right back. <laughs> so I'll be staying home on my birthday while Nick's here working. And um, and that's pretty much it. So um, let's go shopping. That's, that could be awesome. What's the, what's the rating this boy? 10. Oh yeah, so that was, that's what mine is. One kilo. Like, and then you like... You just like... Can't like these bad boys are. You know what You can just keep going down and down. And it's just like... It presses it right down. That's wild. Yeah. yeah. You can dense it right down. So you stuff them in there. You don't even have to roll it up or anything. And then you yeah, tie them down. Yeah, too big, bro. It's pretty big. Think about your, like, your bags and stuff and how much space you have. You want to like... put that in the bag and not just strap it down on top of the net? Yeah, you can. I'm just saying, we're going to get a 
to a time where we're traveling in April and in South Australia, it gets... It's hot. <laughs> There's quite a large difference. Yeah, fair, fair <laughs> I get that one if you want that one. No, I'm just saying it's because I like this because imagine we go to a place where for a time and it's mad cold, we have to buy another one, don't you think? Well, yeah, like we get a liner. I got a liner. Yeah, bro, 100%. Come on. Oh, come on. For the fact that it's zero. Okay. Yeah, oh, should it now get blue or, or, or brown? Uh, anyway. <laughs> Matt's hey. I need a mat. I need a mat. Zero, 220, taper ting. How much is it? This is like 40 bucks. Oh, 40 bucks, what a bargain, eh? Yeah. Bargain Five. camping. Yeah. We need a mat, yeah. So something that rolls down hella small. Can we check short hike mat? I want to know what that is. What is that? Bro. Is that it? Holy crap, that's <laughs> tiny. <laughs> Holy crap, can you just lay down on the floor? Okay. Let's say we bought this. Oh my god. <laughs> it doesn't even do anything! <laughs> this is for a toddler! <laughs> Actually, you know, it's not that bad. Actually? It's, I guess I was mean, on a soft ground. Yeah, your legs are off. <laughs> that is tiny, hey. Holy crap. I mean... It's not that bad. Not bad. You gotta test them out. The green one's a little bit smaller, hey? No, yeah, let's test this out. Yeah, I think we might have found another one. This is nice. This is good. This is the Danelli camper comfort mat. Um, so this is how they compare. What do you think? But like laying down on it. Oh yeah, yeah, that was yeah, that's another comfort. That's the comfiest one out of all of them so far. Yeah, I reckon we just get these. I reckon that's our mat. They're cheaper too. So we're looking at this first. Looks cool. $114. It's just literally like it is a it is a tent. It is a hiking tent and it packs down to that. It's pretty small, hey. It is. Yeah. Really that's that, what you need. That's your that's that's your gear right there. It's pretty small. This, one. this is the bivy I was looking at. Oh. This is another one. This is 190 though. What does it look like? That's what I got. Yeah, so that's what I want to see one set up. Because I want to lane it. It's like 1.2 kilos heavier, you I think. You can feel it. Yeah. Like, yeah. There's nothing. Yeah. Should we, should we assemble it? I think so. Alright, no, we're assembling it. We're doing it. We're doing it here. <laughs> yeah, just wrap that up for his brother. <laughs> so we tested it out and, um,. Honestly, man, you guys should have that set up already. Uh, it's, your, it's your own fault. It's your, yeah, it's your own yeah, fault, man. Yeah, it's your own fault, Anaconda. So we tried, it's just so small, so ridiculously small. And if the dew in the morning, it's gonna everything's gonna get wet. So we're gonna just go with this little cheap boy. See if it holds up. How many nights of camping? Like seven? We'll see how it holds Five, up. Six. Five. But yeah, get in here and there's like, there's like ample space for activities. Sit here, can do like working on a Mac. Put that down, stuff all the stuff. Have really nice cozy sleeps. I like this. I actually like this. Yeah, it's great. That's what I said when I got in there. I was like, yeah. this is dope. It's a two it's a two person as well, so you have a space for like bags and stuff. Or another person. Yeah, that's pretty enough. <laughs> yeah, you can. If we're scared, <laughs> we can just literally just put both hands together. Cards? Yeah, that's right. Uno, pick up four. Ah, it's actually pretty good. Yeah, it is. I fit. Yeah, you actually fit. If Nick fits, it's hey. all you know, I'm f***ing f***ing f***. What an idiot. What an idiot. I've got, I've got editing to do. <laughs> I'm just screwing myself over. I'm f***ing myself over. Yeah. This tent is okay. sick. It's so like tent's a vibe. And if it's not a vibe, uh, you're going to hear about it. Alright, so two of those. Crap. What happened? What happened? It was pack horse. All right, guys. Well, that's it. I think we're gonna just check this out, and then we're just gonna bail home. Um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit like, hit subscribe. If you want to keep up to date with our ridiculous adventure, it's gonna be so gnarly. We leave in less than two weeks now. It's counting down. Uh, next week, we're doing the unboxing of the Foresight helmets. Me and Nick are both doing it. It's gonna be sick. You're gonna froth in it. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Peace. <laughs> Any last words? Um. 
Uh, <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I'm around the backy, baby. Around the backy. You. First, we'll start that. Yes. 